Hi, I'm Sean Gannett, and this is Minutemen. And today we're learning about finding x-intercepts and y-intercepts. Minute math, minute math. When you need help, you use minute math. So the definition for for how to find x-intercepts and y-intercepts are such: given an equation, find the intercepts. Find the x-intercept by setting y equals to zero and solving for x. Find the y-intercept by setting x equal to zero and solving for y. Okay. So uh, every line here will have an x and y intercept. Well, every, <laughs> almost every line. If you have a vertical or horizontal line, you won't have both. Okay. So what we want to do, let's say we're given this example and let's go find the x and y intercept of it. We're given y equals negative 3x minus 4. So we want to find the intercepts there and then sketch the graph using those intercepts. So first thing here to find the x-intercept, we first want to set y equal to 0. Okay? So we're going to take our equation here and set it y or set y equal to 0. So we have the equation y equals negative 3x minus 4. And y is going to be 0 here. So 0 for y, plugging that in negative 3x minus 4. We want to add a 4 to both sides. Pretty basic. Positive 4 here equals a negative 3x. Divide both sides by a negative 3. And we have x by itself is equal to negative 4 thirds. And so we have the coordinate point here, negative 4 thirds, comma, 0. Okay. Again, 0 is the y value. And then we found negative 4 thirds is the x value that goes with it. So let's go find the y-intercept. Again, set here, now instead of y equal to 0, x to 0. x equals 0. And we write our equation, y equals negative 3x minus 4. Plug 0 in for x, so y equals negative 3 times 0 minus 4. Well, 0 times anything is 0, so we have y equals negative 4. So the coordinate point here would be x value of 0, y value is negative 4. Okay? So now we have what we see here is our y-intercept, and this one's our x-intercept. So we're going to use these two points to graph this line. So bear with me for a second. I'm going to plot this graph. So now we have our graph here. Again, a little off, but I don't have graph paper, so it's all freehand. And we want to plot our two intercepts. So the first one's a little tricky. Four, negative 4 thirds is the x value, and the y value is 0. So negative 4 thirds is somewhere past a negative 1, and it's really negative 1 and 1 third, which is roughly here. So I'll leave that point here, negative 4 thirds, comma, 0. Okay. Now, the other coordinate point, so that's the x-intercept. Our y-intercept is 0, negative 4. What will easier. 0 for the x value, y is negative 4. There's our point. We have 0, negative 4 here. And then all we need to do now is connect these two dots to make a line. And let's see if I can do it. Not the prettiest, but it works. And we have y equals, our line, y equals negative 3x minus 4. And now we've graphed it using our intercepts here. So I hope you learned something. If you did, please subscribe to our channel and like this video. This helps us make more free math lessons for you. And as always, thanks for watching. Minute math, minute math. When you need help, you use minute math. Minute math, minute math. When you need help, you use Minute Math, MinuteMathTutor.com.